Well, I wasn't... If you're just gonna give it to me, game, if you're just gonna be a total bro and just put it right in my way, then why not, right? And we're good. There's a level four. Heart and Triforce. Beautiful. Didn't want, want to go back into level four. Level four has nothing to offer me. Should I check the raft locations? I might find the letter. But I don't think I really need the letter either. Don't think I will need it. It was this screen has the magic sword. Hello, magic sword. Get in my face, please. Thank you. Did I buy food? Okay. Was there a shop somewhere? That I can buy food. So if I get to level 7 and I need the food, I'm going to be really bummed. That's going to be bad news. No letter, no medicine. You know what? No, let's just go for it. Let's just go for it. If I get to level 7 and I need food, I will just leave and go in search of food. I didn't write where any of the food shops were, because why would I do that? But we should be in good shape. Just down here, bottom left corner. Cross it my fingers, we won't need... We won't run into Grumble Grumble. Or that if we run into him, we won't actually have to walk through his room. Alright, level 7. What you got for me? The bomb guy was right next door to me. And this was as far as I could get, because no stepladder. Oh, this, there must be wall masters in here. And there are. I was like, wait a minute, that door's not opening? This isn't the second quest. Second quest, you have one-way doors that just don't open, but you don't in the first quest. First quest is a lot nicer. Do I even need the item for level 7? What's left? The candle? The book? Kinda not interested in either of those. The magic boomerang? Kinda not interested in that either. No, I don't think we're gonna need the, uh... The item from here. That dig dogger had nothing. It's so rare that I get to kill a dig dogger in this randomizer. Didn't even have anything on him. Should have bombed some of these walls before picking that up. I don't know the layout to the level 7 rooms very well. So we're just gonna check. I'm glad that I checked. Triforce? Bombs. Alright, well. Again, glad I checked. We'll take him. Oh, I can't wait to run into Aquamentus in this dungeon. Aquamentus just ain't got nothing. Okay, let's get the wand back out. That's the whistle, Brick Road. Somebody yelled at me in my chat on Twitch the other night because I called it the whistle and not the recorder. Sometimes I upset people on the internet. Nothing I can do about it, guys. Nothing I can do about it. And a key. And I don't think I can bomb anywhere. There should not be rooms to either of these sides. I'm going to check anyway, just in case. And I know there's not one to the bottom, so now we can move on. This leg of level 7 was basically just a waste of bombs in order to find a couple more bombs. And to kill a dig dogger, which I guess is okay. Let's just check this here. Or did I already check that? I might have already checked that. I might have just wasted bombs in a spot where I really didn't need to. Nothing doing. We're going to be out of spaces to check in a minute here. Ah! 
A passage reveals itself. Okay, secret passage or item. The monster roar that usually indicates when you're in a room next to the boss room, that doesn't change. That's like hard-coded into the room. So we're hearing the boss roar, but that does not necessarily mean that there's a boss nearby. Doesn't mean that there's not, either. It just, you know. Not even gonna take it. Don't even need it. Magic boomerang. Not worth it. Seer passage. Ooh, we're gonna kill these Dodongos, though. And, uh... Get a couple more bombs. How am I gonna get this guy? He's gotta walk out. That's going to be a secret passage, but it's going to stay open, because the Dongos always stay dead. It might just be a secret passage to this room here, actually, because this is what the secret passage room that's usually in the top right corner of level 7 is shaped like. It might literally be a secret passage that only takes you one room. I'm starting to get nervous now, because we're getting pretty deep in this dungeon, and I have not... We might still run across Grumble Grumble. This might be him here. Nope. Nope, we're still good. I should have tried bombing before picking up those bombs, but I didn't. And then we got spikies on top of shooties. Here's Grumble Grumble. No, there's not. I wish you would have been Grumble Grumble. Because I could have just walked in and walked right past him. Yeah, we're going to check these walls before I grab my free bombs there. Glad I did. Let's check this room down here, too. That was fun. Um, no rooms to bomb into from here. Okay. This room is the lag monster room. Why even put Stalfos in level 7? I don't really get it. Take a free heart, why not? So the only hearts I'm missing run from level 1 to level 5. All the other hearts I've got. Oh, way down there, huh? Okay, well I guess we're walking back then. Yeah, interesting. I want to see if that secret passage just takes me one room away. That would be hilarious. That would be pretty funny. So Leia, level 7 is just a big, empty nothingness. But we should be able to go for right from here to level 9. There's a bunch of places on the overworld I didn't check for my letter, but it's like the only major overworld item I didn't find. And I shouldn't need it. I shouldn't need a lot of drank to get through level 9 in the first quest of Zelda. Especially considering I might not even have to play all of it. But we might have to bomb down into this room here, so let's... I don't think I checked before. Nothing doing? Okay, fair enough. I do want to check the secret passage, though, because how funny would that be? Best secret passage ever. Yeah, it is. It's going to take me one room south. That is hilarious. Look at this mess. The Dodongos came back! That doesn't seem kosher to me. Can I bomb over here? Yes. Goodbye, Dodongos. And then I should just be able to bomb south here. No. The hell you say? The mystery thickens. I'm so bad at killing Dodagos with only one bomb. Almost always have to use two. So maybe I can bomb to the left from here? I didn't try? Really? Okay, so, come up from below then, I guess. 
But it looks like I don't need Grumble Grumble. Because there's no space on the map for Grumble Grumble to go between rooms that I've been in and the Triforce room. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. I think I know what happened, actually. And this is pretty hilarious. Because we went over this way. This guy sold me bombs. Do I have to bomb? No, this wasn't the cell. Oh, I bought the bombs at level 5, I think. Okay, no, I just... There's a wall. I just didn't check. We're done now. And we're red for some reason. We are Fire Link. Squeaky chair. This is the ballad of the squeaky chair. Alright, we gotta get back to level 9. So... We're gonna whistle until it takes us to level 3. I think I was facing the wrong way there. Nope, there we go. We're, we're good. And this is right next door to level 9, which is really level 2. We didn't even warp to level 3, we to level 8. But the randomizer's weird. All the levels are in different spots. So cray-cray, guys. Life is good. Alright, now that I've got Triforce, I can go in. Let's go ahead and get my... Bombs equipped. We don't need to look for anything in this dungeon. We just have to get to... We just have to get to Ganon. I'm going to conserve bombs. Because I have no idea where... That door didn't open. That's very strange. Okay. I was going to try to conserve bombs, but now it looks like I'm going to bomb into level 9. That room's not bumble. This door didn't open either. What? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Did I break it? Is everything broken? It opened that time. That's bizarre. Hope oh, I can bomb here. I'm glad I could bomb here, otherwise this would have been an unwinnable level 9. Which is very strange, but... Okay. So... I'm weirded out. I didn't find the book, either. That's the only other item I'm missing is the book from Dungeons. Let's just peace out from the wizard robe room. Why not? Oh, you know what? I will clear some... I'll, any easy rooms I'm going to clear, because if I get the compass, that'll just tell me where I need to go. Which is good. Don't get me like-like. Oh, Jesus. I almost ate it right there from that like-like. I panicked, guys. I panicked. I forgot which way to go. So the way I have the randomizer set, I should have to fight Ganon in order to get to Zelda. I won't just randomly bumble into Zelda's room, which is possible otherwise. It's possible and it's funny when you step two rooms in level 9 and, oh, there's Zelda. We're going to... I gotta remember, I don't have any drank either, so I can't play level 9 really recklessly like I normally do. I can't just run out and buy all the drank in the world. Perfect Patra fight. The best. Can I wand Patra? I don't I guess not. I didn't try, but I'm I'm assuming not. Nope. That's Nopeville. Population nope. So we're not going that way. Mmm, these bubbles. Oh god, oh god. I guess getting hit by the bubble, like, it doesn't really hurt me that much. I just can't use my sword for a few seconds, but I guess I can use the invincibility frames to, uh... do stuff if I wanted to? To dodge a little better? 
I think you can fight these guys with bombs too, but again, trying to conserve my bombs if possible. <laughs> 